as well as your own show that's going to be debuting on A&E very, very soon. Tell us a little bit about what's been going on behind the scenes and what it's been like filming. Oh, the show's a lot of fun. You know, we've got a lot of different, uh, you know, the storylines are really good. And uh, we got a lot of, lot of good stuff, so I'm pretty excited about it. Are we going to learn that MC Hammer is definitely a family man? Uh, watch and see. Watch and see. How many kids all together participate? Uh, well, there's six kids in the house. Yeah, six kids, and uh, we got a we got a pretty big extended family as well. So it's a lot going on. And we're hearing that you're you a lot of people. You know, once they finish with one career, they move on to another. And watch a few clips that you had from the show. We're going to be showing you some of them right now. Um, that you're you changed your life around a little bit. Tell us what you've been up to now. Well, I, I don't know. Uh, I'm, I've been pretty consistent with what I'm doing for the past uh, 20 years, you know, uh, but I'm, I'm concentrating a lot on uh, everything that I do, everything from music uh, to family to uh, community commitment, I, I, you know, I, and uh, social media, so I'm pretty consistent. As far as your family is concerned, who is the, who is the one person that you have the most difficult problem raising? Who, who should we keep an eye out for on the television show? Uh, Sammy. Three-year-old, yeah, the three-year-old. Is this personality similar to yours? Well, well all of them got some of their daddy in them. I mean, okay. that's automatic, yeah. Okay. And as far as the show is concerned, is it something that we're going to be able to kind of gear towards family values and learn the lessons that we might be experiencing problems facing raising our own kids? Or why, why did you decide to do the show? Well, yeah, I think you'll, you'll find a lot of that in there. Uh, uh, the reason why I did the show is because I think it's a good time for family-oriented, real-life programming uh, that centers around uh, you know, today's environment. So uh, this is not like you know a, a 2005 or a 2015. It's a 2009 family focused on right now. So I think it'd be very relative to uh, a lot of families. Were they comfortable right away with the cameras coming into the house? Yeah, they're comfortable. There's been cameras all around before they were born, and there was cameras around when they were born, so they're comfortable. Any of them taking an interest in music by any chance? Um, throughout the course of the series, um, you, you'll see some surprises with that. And I, you, we were eavesdropping. I heard you mention that you're going to be appearing on Dignation with Alex and Kevin in a, in a few days. Well, you know, over the last uh, week or so, you know, everything from... What, been a lot of shows, a lot of shows, a lot of promotional things, and certainly uh, Dig Nation is going to be one of them. What's up? It's MC Hammer, and you're watching Be Inside TV. My name is Stanley Burrell, but most people know me as MC Hammer. The Hammer Pants, the Hammer Dance, 50 million records. Like life, I've had my ups, and I've had my downs. How does someone blow 33 million bucks? When I look in the mirror, I, I say, uh-uh. Some things were out of order, and I learned a lot. A lot has changed since I wore those baggy pants, but family is the only constant. They keep me going. And here we are, a big house and a lot of family. That's my life. It's the American way, and we doing it every day. Hammer time. Family. This is family. Of the fam, big ham, dig that. Hey, family, this is family. Family, family, family. The hammer family. 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 Hammer time.
the town that we're in right now is called Tracy, California. I came to Tracy because I wanted the peace and quiet. I wanted to, you know, reorganize and refocus uh, my life. I knew I couldn't do that with too much going on. And so I've been living here for about 12 years and uh, I love it. All right, have a beautiful day in the valley. Good morning, good morning. Hey, good morning. Hey, good morning, Sam. Good morning. Good morning. Sammy was a preemie, one pound, 10 ounces. He came into the world as a fighter. Sammy will definitely brighten your day. Daddy gonna get a cup of coffee. Okay, Daddy. Okay, Daddy. All right. Good, last one, too. Thank you. You must have saved this one for me. Yep, that's yours. My wife, Stephanie, is the greatest supporter of Hammer, the performer, Stanley, the father, Stanley, the husband, She's been there for the whole journey. Honey, have you seen my phone? No, I, I think it was in the family room. I'm not sure. I got to have my phone. Booby, you, you see my phone? Mm. Well, Stanley Jr., uh, affectionately known as Booby, is 13 years old, and he is the spitting image of his dad. This place is a mess. How, how in the world? Look at this. Well, you did this with all these toys around here? No. Oh, look at this room. I, if it's in here, I'd never find it. I'm going to find anything in here. Oh, no, that's not me. Oh, this is a mess, man. This, this room is a this. mess. Boy, what's this, this? My nephew, Jamar, is, he's uh, 18 years old now. He's been living with me since he was almost 11. He is a real football player. The fire, the passion, and the talent to go along with it, he has that. Sarah, hmm? have you seen Daddy's iPhone? No, I rarely see your cell phone. Sarah is always Miss Little Shy. And at 15, Sarah moves when Sarah wants to. <laughs> I need my phone. I'm going through withdrawals right now. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I can't really help you. I haven't seen it. Uh, Jeremiah, well, look at this room. Another mess. Oh, have you seen my phone? Nah. Jeremiah, he's only 10 years old, but he has a heart of gold. Jeremiah, this room is a mess. How did this room get like this? It wasn't me, it was Sammy. I got a resolution, because this is too much. Every room in this house needs to be cleaned up. TV. Check us out on the web.